DVT has many ways to inspect and debug preprocessing macros. For example, to see the defined value of a simple macro, just hover it with the mouse cursor. For more elaborate macros, it's easier to inspect the preprocessed code in the editor. To unravel a macro call, place the editor cursor on it, right-click, and select Macros, expand one level in line. Note that the macro call is commented out and replaced with a macro definition code with all parameters replaced. In a similar way, you can apply preprocessing for a block of code. This time, let's expand all levels in line. Note that the nested macro calls have been replaced as well. Any macro expansion adds a high priority reminder in the tasks view so that you don't forget to collapse it when you're done debugging. To undo the macro expansion, you can either right-click on the marker or place the editor cursor on the DVT expand macro inline start pragma, right-click and select macros collapse inline expansion. Two very convenient shortcuts are assigned to the expand and collapse sections. Control Shift Plus to expand and Control Shift Minus to collapse. When trying to collapse a modified macro expansion, a dialog pops up to present the differences, so you can make sure that all of your changes have been reviewed and ported to the macro definition.